Cerebral palsy is a neurological condition which causes stiffness in my legs. Um, it was caused through being born premature and it means that I use a wheelchair for my mobility. Growing up with a disability at times was challenging, just being quite different to those around me. And I struggled with my confidence at times as well, especially being young and you know just wanting to be a part of what's going on. When I was in primary school, I was excluded from sport at school, so I never really felt like sport was for me or for people with disabilities. When I was watching the London 2012 Paralympic Games, I was just so inspired and it was really a light bulb moment, realising that sport is for everybody and disabled people could become professional athletes. My journey's been quite a crazy one really, just from watching the Paralympic Games to actually representing my country at the next Paralympic Games. So I went to the Rio 2016 Games, which was so amazing. It was a real dream come true. I got a silver and two bronze medals. And then at the Tokyo 2020 Games, I got two silver medals. My disability and sport really opened a huge door for me and just to see how God's used my disability and for his glory is something that really makes me very proud. I was initially quite hesitant around sharing faith online. I think for me it was always just knowing what's the right thing to share. And I want to make sure that what I'm talking about is truthful and you know aligned with, with the Bible. It was a challenge, but at the same time, I knew just how much my faith meant to me and how much knowing Jesus has changed my life and transformed my life. So at the same time, it was that desire to share that with other people. Because I really think that if something matters to you and if you love someone, if you love something, you know, you want to share that with others. I started sharing my faith a lot more online over lockdown. I just found talking about my own experience, my own testimony really works, linking it to sport as well. So whenever I'd have like a really big competition or something, I'd like to post about it, but also share about how important my faith has been in that moment. And also just sharing the things that I enjoy, even looking at online, sharing Christian content, and just helping people to realize how central um, faith is for a lot of young people. There's lots of pressures when it comes to being an athlete. There's a lot of expectation. It can feel like you're alone. You've just got that lane and you're really focused on your performance. And I think that's why my faith is so important to me because it's realizing that I'm not alone. And it's just knowing that God's with me. In my podcast, I'm really trying to allow athletes to really be open around their journey, around the ups and downs, being really honest about their struggles, but also about how God has helped them through that. It's just creating a safe, open space where people can share the highs and lows of their sporting journey and also their faith journey. Sharing faith online has really opened up conversations, especially with teammates. I can understand that it is quite difficult for a lot of people to get past um, what they can see or to believe in a picture that they don't fully know yet. And I think that's why it's so important that we have conversations and, and are open with people and hear their perspective and get an understanding of where they are so that we can actually support them. Since sharing my faith, I've realised that it isn't something to be afraid of, that God has given me the words to say and that people are really open to have these conversations and sometimes all it takes is just a question or all it takes is just us sharing our story and that can open so many doors of opportunity.